Good afternoon everyone. It's Friday afternoon. I've had a nice day off. Kate and I are about to head to Ikea because we're going to get me a desk. Pretty excited. Kate does not like Ikea at all. No. I'm actually a huge fan. I like the stuff they sell, but the setup makes me anxious. <laughs> Don't like it. I just, it's like, it's so much fun. All right, see you in a bit. Welcome to Ikea. Like Disneyland. <laughs> I love it. You get like this like crazy little tunnel you're walking under the street right now. It's hilarious. So here we are. Excited. <laughs> Having ourselves a little obligatory IKEA meal. You excited, babe? So excited. No matter which direction you look, IKEA looks like an ad in a magazine. Let's 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 observe. Ad in a magazine. Ad in a magazine. Oh. Look how cute the piggy is. Look at it. God damn it. It's a broccoli stuffed animal. <laughs> So, back home. Ikea was a breeze, wasn't it? So easy. So easy. Nah! Tested for even the most rigorous sex. Welcome to Cooking with the Broke Angelino. See, when you're broke, you gotta be creative. Look at that beautiful stew. Doesn't that look delicious? I'm now convinced that Ikea is a social experiment. Kind of like a rat finding the cheese situation. Just a giant maze that you've got to walk all the way through in order to get anywhere. There is literally no end in sight. So, we've survived the dreaded IKEA. Did we not, babe? We did. All right. We did it. Now, we, as in, and as in we, I mean I, have all this to build. Yeah. Hey. 